Shut up and sit down. Greetings, fellow Earth Travelers. Oblix here, coming at you today from Subnautica. How y'all doing today? So I figured we'd try something a little bit new and a little bit different. Oh, well, yeah, a big old piece of metal banged us in the face. Well, yeah, it did. Well, thank you. I will. If I need it, I'll get the... Well, thank you for the luck. I appreciate it. How y'all doing today? So I figured we would jump into Subnautica. I love this game. And I've always wanted to do a series on it and just never have. Hello, little flying creature. You're new. Oh, look at you. You think? We call it a crash. Master of the understatement. So, yeah, I have played this game before, but it has been a while. It's actually been through quite a few updates since the last time I gave it a go. And there's a lot more to the game than wasn't there before. Now, why are the waves going that way? When th If that thing just crashed, the water would be rushing outward. Unless I just was knocked out in here for a ridiculously long time. Uh, so yeah, there's been a lot of changes since the last time I played, so there's going to be a bunch of new stuff, and a bunch of things I'm not going to remember and know, so we're going to learn as we go. I know the first thing we want to build is one of these repair tools, because we got to fix this sparking thing here, or we're going to get shocked. Actually, you can't really get shocked, I don't think, but we need to go fix it anyway. Now, to get it, we need that, it used to be called crash powder, now I think it's called something else. Uh sulfur or something, I don't know. Ooh, limestone, hello. Let's get that. Yes, it is. Yeah, I'm telling you. Well, that's because I'm pretty much amazing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, this game is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. If you've seen it before, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't seen it before, just watch along because it is absolutely stunning they've done a great job and it is now fully released uh, last time I was playing it it was still an early development uh, we need to go down here into these caves and find some bad dudes oh I hear them let's see I see you that guy right there He's going to jump out after us. Oh, and try to come kill us. And he's going to fail miserably. Excellent. Now we got to go get his bits. Get a little oxygen. And we go back. Ooh. That looks like one of their eggs. Now, are there more of them in here? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give there we go. Excellent. Now we get a 
little oxygen. Now we gotta find some titanium. Hmm. Oh, those are fart bubble fish. You swim next to them and they release fart bubbles. Like that. And those things explode into nasty, noxious gas. Hence, fart bubble fish. Ah, hello, scrap metal. I will take you. You will become titanium for me. And I will take you because you're going to become water. Where'd you go? Come here. Ah. Yes, it was. Now I need something to munch upon. Who wants to be dinner? You want to be dinner? Aha, you want to be dinner. Excellent. Get a little more. Oxygen's a big thing early on. Constantly got to be. Now that, that's an egg. We don't want to be getting that right now. Stop, fart bubble fish. I think we will need a couple of acid mushrooms. We'll pick those up. I'd like to get a little more titanium, I think. It's usually pretty easy to find, but just a scrap laying around. I'm not seeing any, though. Ah, there's some. Gimme, gimme, gimme. That should get us going. Wow. Now, we'll go back in here. And first thing I want to do is cook us up. Now these, um, I'll show you here. This fish here, this bladder fish, will turn into food or water. Uh, generally, you want to turn it into water. And hitting the right buttons is a good thing. So we'll turn that guy into H2O. And then we'll cook this boomerang fish. So here's our health here's our oxygen our food and our water so let us a munchie we'll eat that or drink that and our water will go up to 90 which is great we'll eat this food we only went up to 56 so we want to get some more food here relatively soon uh, go back in here we're going to convert this scrap into titanium and we're gonna see about building a repair tool we need some silicon rubber okay to make silicon we need creep vine seed clusters which means we got to go into a bad place uh, now where is it from here probably oh, ah, over there So these are creep vines. And these little yellow bits are creep vine seed clusters. Oh, nice. Look at the shadow. It looks like I got a mohawk. Uh, but there's bad dudes that live in this area, let me tell you. Give me the stupid creep vine. Thank you. Yeah, there's a couple different baddies that live in that area that you do not want to jack around with. Uh, I would like to eat you. Come here big eyeball yeah. oh, there's our ship you can always orient yourself based on where your ship is seems to be the easiest way anyway let's get a little more munchy we'll cook the peeper Yes, I am aware of this. I, I just told the peeps that. Thanks, Master of the Obvious. Let's make the silicon. Silicon rubber. And then we're going to make that repair tool. Dende. So now we're going to eat our peeper. Nom, 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 nom. 
and we're doing pretty good health wise we're going to pop out our repair tool and for whatever reason shoot our own finger because apparently we're really smart and there we go repair the radio nice everything's repaired now we want to get to making a scanner so we need a banner or a banner battery which we have the stuff for some copper and some acid mushrooms now we can make our scanner Oh no, it's nighttime. Well, nothing worse comes out at night. That's good news. Now we can use the scanner to just scan everything. That's not 100% necessary. There are some things you have to scan. You don't have to scan everything there is to scan, but the more you scan, the better. Um, it goes into your like little data bank thing. Come back, peeper. I'm trying to scan you. Gotcha. These little rays are hard to scan. Because they start swimming real fast. Gotcha. Yes, yes, yes. Breathe. Got it. So you're going to have this little guide that you can go in and learn about more stuff. So the more you scan, the more you can learn. Hey, I'm trying to scan a boomerang. Get out of the way. Gotcha. Now we got to go scan fart bubbles. Come on, fart bubble. Get yourself scanned. Oh, I heard a stalker. Well, those have been in the game a long time. And I remember them from long ago. They're bad news bears. So we'll pick one more of those just to have them. Ah. Well, I'm not going in there. Oh, I would like to catch you. Thank you. Uh-oh. He sounds like he's just struggling so much when he comes out of there <laughs> under the water. Um, oh, there's a hoverfish. Nice. I catch you? Could I catch you? I will eat you. Yeah, they seem to be a little more docile in the evening. Most of the fish do. Tend to be a little easier to catch. Though they do like to juke and jive. And I know it's very dark. We're going to be getting lights here before long, hopefully. And that will make things all the more better. Alright, so we do have a message waiting. I don't want to get that just yet. Um, what do we need to do? What have we even got in our inventory? Let's see. Uh, some dinner. Um, let's get that egg out of our inventory. We don't want to carry that around. So this is like a little early game storage bin you can use. Though it fills up pretty quick. Uh, let's 
Let's get some food. Cook a hoverfish. And I want to get into a Kniffy. So there. Well, I'm glad it's an exception. Uh, we don't need the fish. And there we go. Okay, so now we need to start working on what? I would like a... Oh, we can already make this. An oxygen tank. So now... See, it just puts it right here, and we can breathe longer. So now where do we want to focus on? What is this? Oh, pipes, air pump. A lot of these things look different from when I remember them. Wouldn't mind some fins to do that. We're going to need some more silicon. Let's go get that real quick. We know where it is. It's relatively easy. It's coming daytime. Okay, and I've lost it apparently. Ooh, there's a wreck over there. We need to go get that. Let's go get um get us some silicon first. So we can get some swim fins. Oh, Gary fish. Hello. Come here, Gary. Gotcha. Now where'd you go? I want to eat you. Never mind. I'll eat you later. Notice how much more oxygen we have than we had before. Get a couple of those. Yeah, we can stand her a whole lot longer than we could before because we built those tanks, which is great. Let's get those fans. Oh, we gotta make the rubber first. Silicon. And. Footies. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Blah, blah, blah. So if we can get some glass and some more titanium and a piece of silver, we can get the higher capacity oxygen tank, which I'm all down for. And then some, a battery and some glass, and we can get a flashlight. So let's get a flashlight. So next night time, uh, we can actually see. So we're going to need battery, which is a couple of mushrooms. Done. And here's a wreck. Fantastic. Ah, oh, we can scan a chair. That means we'll be able to build one later. Let's get some O2. Uh, that is a thermal vent. We used to could use those for power. I don't know if we still can or not. Uh, perhaps. See, is there anything else? Aha! There's goodies in these boxes. Sea glide. Oh yes, we want the sea glide. More sea glide. Done. Got it. Excellent. Means we'll be able to move around much, much quicker. And I think that's all that's right here. I did see a, a little bit of scrap over here. We'll grab. And zorp. And a little limestone chunk. Some more titanium. 
Some more titanium. We'll go ahead and scan that. A lot of times in these tubes, there's uh, limestone chunks. More titanium. Oh, a sandstone. Nice. Silver. That was something we needed to build silver. Or something we needed silver to build with. What? Words. Words in my mouth. Let's see what else we see while we're out here. Table coral. Always good. I forget what it's needed for, but it's needed for something or other. Ooh, something else to scan. What is in you? Oh, sea glide. We already have the sea glide. That'll just give us more titanium. But I will happily use more titanium. Happily use more titanium. There's another one. That's probably more. Yep, more sea glide. More scrap. You gotta be kind of careful not to pick up too much because you only you have limited storage space early on. Uh, coral shell plate. That's different. Let's get this and. Uh, where, where my thing you go? There it is. There it is. Pop up in here. Now, give me the stuffs. We want to. What do we? We gotta do things. What are we? What were we trying to make? Uh, we're trying to make something. Oh, we're gonna make a flashlight, which means we need a battery and some glass. Battery we can do. Uh, can we do a battery? Thought we could do a battery. We never got copper. What do we get the silver for? Wasn't that? Uh, what was the silver for? Ah, this. So we need more glass either way. Okay. So we've got to go back out and get the glass. We got plenty of space. So let's get some glass. The glass is quartz. And quartz is like a crystalline looking stuff. Probably, I don't want to pick up too much scrap. Oh, but I need the crystals. Give me the quartz. Hello, crashfish. I will take you bits. And there's quartz. And there's sulfur, I will take it. Ah, there's our quartz. There's some limestone. That's another egg, I'm not gonna worry about that. I will swim up through the little hole. That's kind of cool, that's a whole cave underneath. I need more quartz. More quartz, please. Yeah, those swim fins help a lot when you're dealing with the crash fish. I need the quartz. Give me the quartz. I don't remember quartz being this hard to find last time I played this game. It seems like it was everywhere. And you need a boatload of it. At least last time I played, you needed a ton of it to craft everything. I'm going to leave that there for now. It sure does seem like it's a lot harder to find than it used to be. You do have to be careful not to get too close to the... Uh, big ship over there because it is radioactive. 
quartz. Tail hunting the quartz. I wonder if they made it biome specific. It didn't. I mean, it used to just spawn. Like in this biome, it spawned everywhere. And there are multiple biomes in this game. I'm really just not seeing any. wonder if they just made it not spawn in this biome very much. That's a stalker. He's bad news bears. Generally, if you stay up high, they don't bother you too much, and they love scrap. They're constantly going after scrap. Uh, also inside of here are these little leech things you want to avoid. Oh, you see that guy? With the yellow spots on him? Let's see if I can get a little closer and avoid the little leech. Yeah, see, he's sick. He's got a disease. He's got a nasty, funky disease that's kind of infecting this planet. Salt. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. You know what's recommended? Finding some quartz. Big old deep caves. I would love to find some quartz. Ooh, floaters. These are cool. They're making that, uh, that rock float. Is quartz only in caves now? The one we found was in a cave. Is that like, oh, let's see, there's crash fish in here. Oh, I already got the crash fish. Thirty seconds. Come here. Oh, my inventory's full. Dang it. What can I get rid of? Piece of titanium. Now, where did that metal go? Where did you go, the metal? Come to me. Oh, did it titanium disappear too? Or is it if it gets too far away from you, it despawns? Did not know. Interesting. Ah, we just got more titanium. Rapo. I can find no quartz. I just want some quartz. All right, we'll go back over here and empty out our pockets. And then we've got to find some bloody quartz. Titanium, the silver, the crash powder, the quartz that we already have. Those big old things. And now let's go get some more. We have to find quartz. There's a big old cave over here next to the poop fish. Let's see. Hello, bugfish. Okay, so it looks like quartz is now relegated to spawning in caves. Good to know. I see a crash fish egg. Which means crash fish. Detecting 
I've already built the repair tool. Thanks for noticing. Oh, swim faster, swim faster. Okay. Oh, I should probably get a bladder fish while I'm up here. There's some next to the poop fish. I don't want to be too close to the poop fish. Oh, don't swim into the poop fish, you stupid fish. Get away from the poop fish. Oh, just get me out of here. I missed! I missed! Why do they always swim into the poop fish? Gotcha! Oh, I missed. Come here! I wasn't even trying to get you. <laughs> All right, that should be good dinner. And up in we go. We will cook a fever. And we will waterize a bladder. Maybe two. And where's our cooked peeper? There he is. Nom, 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 nom. And we'll drink some water and drink some more water and drink some more water. They don't give you very much water. And let's go ahead and cook that boomerang as well. Delish. Pretty much good to go there. Now we need to, let's turn that scrap into titanium. And zorp, 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 get all that squared up. Oh, is there more? Good Lord. Got all the titanium. Now, do not convert it into titanium ingots because you cannot convert it back. Made that mistake before. Now we need a piece of glass. And we should be able to make... Oh, we need a battery. Dang it, Bobby. What about our super de-duper? We have silver. We have enough to make two glass? Two more glass? Can we do two more glass? Let's see what we have. Uh, we can make one more glass. Dang it. Okay, sweet. I think we're going to go ahead and make the flashlight first. So we're going to need copper and... Do we have any copper? We don't have copper. Oh, wait. We can make two more glass. Fantastic. Um, we could use a piece of copper, though. So let's make, what am I making? Oh, come on, think, think, Oblix, think. One glass, two glass. And we need our standard O2 tank, which is that, which we should already have. Why is it saying we don't have it? And a piece of silver. Let's grab our silver, uh, silver. And our O2 tank. Now we pop that in here. Now we should be able to make the high capacity oxygen tank. Fantastic. Why it's smaller, I don't know. Uh, okay, so now to make the flashlight, we still need a battery. To make the battery, we need copper. 
but we got the big old high capacity oxygen tank so now we can stay under even longer of course it is pitch flipping black all right and we got these we just need yeah we just need the copper okay let's listen to our first message Well, let me hold my breath. <laughs> nine, 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 nine hours. I don't think you're coming to save me, Aurora. That's the impression I'm left with. So. All right, everybody. I do think that is going to do it for today on our first episode of Subnautica. I am super excited to get into this game and see where it takes us and see what they've done, what new updates have happened in this game. Can't wait. I hope you guys are excited too. And until next time, you guys get out there and make some noise. We'll see you.